hey guys welcome back to my channel so this is paul okoye and his relationship status has been you know trending on the internet for some time now well on this photo you see him and his very first wife okay the first picture is that of him and the girl that is anita her name is anita during their university days they met in 2004 and they finally got married in 2014 after 10 years well they had three children and they were really having a wonderful family until you know infidelity stepped in and disrupt the whole marriage life well when his wife discovered that he was cheating his wife filed for a divorce him um paul okoye did not really liked it and things did not go well so on this um paper you see that um anita tonye okonye who is the petitioner is the one who asked for divorce and uh, the court procedure you know it continued for some time well the sister of uh, paul okoye also presented some documents as evidence as you see here so on this paper you see that according to the documents presented in court miss okoye's lawyer cited an instance of catching the artist having an illicit affair with their maid that i know this is in quote listen very well that i know as a fact that the respondent on 11 june 2020 through the petitioner's sister and I out of the house after we discovered that he had he had started an illicit affair with one of the house helps by name Florence, the court document said. Also attached to the court document were multiple charts of Paul Okoye and other women to prove that he is infidel. Well, due to all this, his wife Anita Okoye decided to relocate to the US of A with their three children. While they were there, everything was good and uh, it was around september 2021 when paul decided to visit the kids and uh, um anita okoye posted a picture on instagram saying papa is here when she made that post paul okoye also added some emojis to the photo and everyone was happy i mean the fans of paul okoye they thought that um this picture signifies that the both of them have fixed their problem and they are back together but that was actually not the case in in april 2021 a court document came out saying that they are now divorced okay i understand why people got it wrong you know when you separate with your partner especially when you people have kids it will happen that uh, from time to time you people will have to meet or you know celebrate something that concerns the child like a birthday their graduation and all that so when they see the when they saw the both of them together they thought that they had fixed fixed things between them but it was not about the two of them as a couple it was about their children so that is how life is well guys um anita okoye has been living a wonderful life as a single mother and there has not been any problem concerning that on Paul's side, recently, he posted a picture of his new girlfriend. The girl is beautiful. She is a Nigerian model and all that. But a lot of people still think that Paul's first wife is more beautiful than the new upcoming wife because he said um, they are, uh, that they are engaged. Well, not everyone sees um, this girl as beautiful. The girl is not ugly, but just that the first wife was more beautiful some people think that this um, girl is just a baby she is too skinny no flesh and all that but well beauty lies in the eyes of the beholder i cannot judge on that because a lot of people stay where there is peace you understand i'm not saying that um his first wife was nagging no don't get me wrong i love his first wife and she was there for him even when he had nothing okay so i prefer the first wife but if um there is um i mean if the marriage is not working anymore as the wife said that they got divorced because of inconsiderable differences so they have to live their life apart i mean they must not stick together just to make it work no if the wife decides to stay alone with the kids it's okay for her but paul cannot stay alone he is a man most men can't stay alone they need a woman in their life while he was married he was cheating now that he is single do you think he will not be with other women of course and whatever um, kind of woman that he chooses that is his problem but you know what is funny in all these things 
most of the people who went online to try to troll this new girlfriend or new fiance of his, <laughs> they got their shock because Paul did not take it lightly with them. Paul decided to screenshot some of the photos of these people who were trolling his new fiance. And he wrote on the picture that one I take a moment and appreciate trolls who call other people ugly. I mean, this is so funny because from their faces, you see that his new girlfriend is more beautiful than all these people trolling his new girlfriend. And when he made that remark, a lot of people started deleting their comments. I mean, because they don't want their picture to come up. <laughs> so he then come up again and posted this uh, post you are seeing. Why are you all deleting comments and going private? I just want to see something. <laughs> So it was so funny and now most people are not saying, uh, they are not insulting anymore like they were doing before because all they were saying was the girl is too skinny, the girl is too young, your first wife is more beautiful and all that. Well, even though to me, I prefer his first wife because of course she is not just beautiful but she was there for him when he was not yet a star or a celebrity and she is the mother of his three children so of course i prefer the first wife but beauty lies in the eye of the beholder okay and when it comes to men it is very difficult to understand the kind of woman that they like most men have said before that they don't like a woman who is fat they prefer women who are slim but they finally got married to women who are very very fat i mean someone would say i don't like a fat woman but he goes ahead to marry a fat woman so this is just to say that um that factor of physical appearance is very, very unpredictable when it comes to a relationship, okay? Another very important point is that uh, people will always prefer partners who gives them peace, okay? I'm not trying to say that um, his first wife did not give him peace. No, I mean, that was not the case. The reason for his divorce is because he was infidel. He was cheating with his housemate named Florence. That's the reason for his divorce. So already that has been done with. But if Paul Okoye find peace in the arms of this um, young model, Ifoma, then there is nothing we can do. We just have to, I mean, accept it and move on. It is better. It is not like um, he's forcing his first wife to come stay in marriage with him while he's with this second girl. No, this is not the case um, like uh, the one of Yul Edoche. No, this one is different. They are divorced, okay? Paul Okoye is divorced with his first wife and now he has to move on. Whatever kind of girl that he chooses should not be our business. If we are still his fans, we just have to support him and wish him well. Even though we know that um, the fact that he was cheating on his first wife means that he can still cheat on the second and third one. Yes, we know about it, but we cannot do anything. That is the problem of the girls who are coming in. That's the problem of the second, third and fourth wife that will come in. It is not our business anymore. We are his fans and not fans of his wife. So I will just um, <laughs> beg everyone to support him in this his journey of um, taking a second wife. And we should just wish them well. I mean, the first wife should be the one crying, not us. So she has moved on, which is good. So guys, this was just like a summary concerning this Paul Okoye's matter that is trending on the internet for those who have not been following up, okay? So here you have all the little details concerning his relationship from when um, he's met his, he met his first wife, when they got married, their relationship, what happened that leads to divorce and finally um, him being with Ifoma Ivy, okay? So guys, if this video was of interest to you, please subscribe to my channel, okay? Like the video, share it, and just support me, alright guys? I'll be seeing you next time in my next video. So have a nice day and bye-bye, your girl Hilda Elbron.